Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. The light's going, I've had a really, really busy day and I was trying to film before the light went, but then we had to do stuff in the loft. Anyway, I've got an unboxing, I'm very excited. Uh, I did say, now I know I've, I've, I've lied a little bit when it comes to bags, but I did say that this year, uh, as well as generally cutting down on my shopping, I also said that I was going to be very careful about what I invest in and also less handbags. As much as I love handbags, I've got handbags and um, there, there's still some handbags that I would like, but I'm really happy to wait and relax into them. You know, I've got enough Hermes, maybe next year I'll buy an Hermes bag. You know, I'm, I'm actually feeling all right about that. I'm not like craving the next one, she says. Um, but what I did want to do with my collection, I did say that I did want to start with, you know, maybe a little bit of ready to wear, but particularly jewellery. I really wanted to invest in some good, decent, nice, classic, easy wear pieces. And again, I wasn't in a massive rush, but I thought, well, this year. And then a friend of mine said that she was selling this and she was selling it this week I've always loved this on her I've tried it on in the past so what was I to do other than be that customer and be that I said customer it's a private sale um, so this is pre-loved but look look how it's come so it's come all in this lovely Cartier bag which she dug out for me. Oops. We have show me this before we get onto the main event. There'll be a quick video. Let's drag it out as not too much because of the light. Um, so it's a little cleaning kit which comes with this jewellery spray, this lotion. So I've got that there, and apparently I can use this um, not on all of it, and I'll explain why, that may be a clue. Uh, unused polishing cloth there as well, which you can see has some branding. Just about make it out there, it says Cartier. And we have this brush with super soft bristles. And a little booklet which I haven't gone through yet but I imagine it is instructions and do's and don'ts and whatnot. not little care booklet probably tells you about different materials and whatnot. so that so you pop that in as a little freebie extra and then here is the main event my first ever piece of Cartier. It doesn't have any paperwork with it, but. So there we go. So this is the Trilogy Ring. So you can see there it's three separate bands. So we've got white gold, black ceramic, and then this white gold with, I think it's about 100 diamonds, the website says. And somewhere on the white gold one it says, yeah, there it is. So there it says Cartier. So it's very subtle. Again, it's a bit of a, if you know, you know. But it's just, it's very me. It's not too big. It's very comfortable. I'm not a massive jewellery wearer. I'm trying to show you. The camera is not wanting to focus today. Um, but yeah, I'm not a massive jewellery wearer. I don't like anything too big and heavy or uncomfortable and this is just super it's just so comfortable it's so 
soft and lightweight and beautiful and tasteful. Um, I can wear this, like I say, just with silver jewellery or um, platinum or white other white gold. Um, I'll probably wear this with my Hermes little bracelet that I got that's new and quite plain. Um, or I can just wear it, like I say, just just as is, just with that. Like I say, I don't wear too, too much. I've got some plain um, diamond stud earrings, so I think it will go with those. So yeah, I'll tell you the exact name of this in case anyone is interested and likes it. Sorry, the lighting is really bad, I'm sorry. But I've got a really busy few days ahead of me. This is a Trinity Ring Ceramic SM, and the retail price of this at the moment in the UK is an eye-watering £6,750, including VAT. Now, obviously, buying this pre-loved and worn um, and, and from a friend, I paid a fraction of that, which was why I almost bit, literally bit a hand off for it, because I've always loved this on her. And um, I know that for my first ever Cartier piece, I'm not going to be paying um, £6,000. £750 for jewellery, that's, I'm not, I'm not in that market. Um, so yeah, I'm absolutely thrilled. Um, I feel sorry for her that she no longer has it, because <laughs> it is beautiful, but I just love it, and I think I'm going to wear it an awful lot. So I'll try and just show you how the three rings go. So you can see them there. They just kind of move, they're sort of interlinked, but are individual rings. And yeah, they just sort of move around a bit. Don't want to drop it, and then it goes on. But the diamonds are just stunning. They're just really white and bright. You can see there the black ceramic, which is nice and shiny. And apparently I shouldn't be using the cleaner on that. So I won't, but just a soft cloth is fine. So that is my unboxing. That is my new to me first ever piece of Cartier. And uh, you can tell I'm still absolutely over the moon because like I say, this year is me making, trying to make wise investments. So when I say investments, I mean investments for me to keep and wear. I don't mean to make money out of. Um, and I think this is a really, gonna be a timeless piece that I will just wear and wear. I have another ring that I bought just from Ernest Jones years ago, which was like a similar sort of style, but without diamonds. It was just like, it was just the black ceramic with a little bit of parve on it on them. And I've worn that so much and got so many compliments from it. So like I say, to have this and just make it a little bit, a little bit special. Um, it's been amazing. Right, the light is going, properly going now. I'm gonna have a sunset soon. So I'm <laughs> believe it or not, I don't, yeah, well it's not raining so I'll take that, so <laughs> I will say goodbye everybody until the next one, which will not be an unboxing, sadly enough, I have no idea what it will be, uh, maybe I'll eventually get around to editing the Japan vlog from when I went to Japan in 2018, who knows, <laughs> we don't know what the future will bring, um, yes I caught the sun and this does look it looks brown in real life, but red on camera, so, um, yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, I will see you very soon, and have a lovely day, evening, weekend, uh, whatever it is that you're doing. Take care, bye.